No, what's this one? All right, we're back. So yeah, we're going over some of the some of the uh, butterfly effects, and one of them was we didn't find a a clue fast enough with Sam to save Josh. Something like that. Yeah. So and and, and the answer was Josh then didn't recognize Hannah enough as the Wendigo to save himself. Which is weird. S- which is a kind of a weird thing. You think it would have because that one out. because to me him like going insane at that point matched with his death. Yeah. Maybe that's just a, a just a form of of good writing. Well, you know what? I'm not so sad that Josh died, but I also recognize that there were ways to save him. Oh shit! So no, we already drank to his death. Never mind. Did we, we? thought he died earlier? Much oh. earlier. Oh. Did we? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we drank to his genuine death this time. Okay, now Jess is still alive, and she's kind of bloody, and she's walking around not feeling like she had a So Matt, Ashley, night. and Josh are definitely dead. Matt, Ashley, yeah, and apparently there's ways to save all three that we just kind of neglected. <sighs> well, the quick time event on Matt is kind of a bum town. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he had to shoot the, the deer either. I didn't shoot the deer axum. Yeah, or you didn't have to act oh. the deer, actually. Oh, yeah. Yeah, until dawn, we're... until dawn, J.D. and J.D. and John playing, yeah. Until yeah. dawn with until J.D. and until John. <laughs> there we go. Is this where it came from? Pick up the pace, girl. How did she get into those jeans? Those are super tight, and her butt looks fantastic. It's like they were made for her ass. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, let's have super skinny jeans that just flow out once I get to the ass part because there's going to be a lot of meat there. Yay! Totems. A totem. Let's check out the top of this totem. Someone's burned to death. Someone's going to burn to death. Uh Uh-oh, there's a loss coming. Great. Maybe we can get Jess killed. If we're lucky, it can... Oh, shit. (laughs) It can happen, but it also shows us how many totems are missing still, too. Yeah. Well, go back to the totem screen. Go go to that one on the far right with the fortune and, and press uh, inspect on the very bottom one. That's what it is. Oh, okay. I thought it, like... Wait, 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 wait. Um... Go back. Which one? This one? Uh, yeah. Press triangle. Sometime after the prospectors came to mine this mountain. You, you notice how many spots are missing in this story? And woke the cr- you notice how there's all that blank space between those different parts? Right. So I feel like you have to get all the totems and then they actually fill in all those blank spaces. Oh, so it's going to fill in the whole story. Yeah. As a total, as opposed to one one totem pole. Yep. Okay. All right, that makes sense. All right, well, whatever. Okay, Jess, go find more totems for us. I think we have enough totems to know the story, though. I think we're pretty sure. I think it's pretty clear what happened. Yeah. Miners got trapped, they ate themselves, they became Wendigo, based on experiments. Yeah, and then they killed the two girls. The two girls had a not-so-nice death. Ashley, Josh, and Matt have died. And Ashley, Josh, and Matt have died. Yeah. And now it's just being chased by Wendigo all the time because Josh is pretty much well, gone. Okay, I'm trying to do this. Okay, there we go. Jess has had some fucking rubbish time, you know? She's been out of her bones. You're going to have to stay still here. She tried to have sex. And she wasn't allowed to have sex. She got really cocky and then they pulled her through the window. She's not maintaining being still at all. (laughs) No, she doesn't really understand what being still means. Although in her defense, she doesn't know any of the story yet either. Oh look, it's a Wendigo. 
It's taking a long time to catch up to her. Break on through to the other side. Just fucking hammer through. Yeah, hammer through that like boarded up mine shaft. <laughs> it works that way, you know. So when to go? Okay, not gonna move. Oh my god! Oh no! Hell. Okay, well she's dead. Oh Christ! Well, just dead move. now. All right. I didn't move. That deserves a tequila shot. Oh God, really? Yeah, unfortunately. What? She is definitely dead now. We saw the death. There's gotta be a way to like reload these sections because that was dumb. Just a tiny bit for me. Nothing really. Yeah. That's what you're getting. I can't believe that shit. Although I did kind of hope that she died. Yep. In all fairness, she should have died earlier, but whatever. Yeah. Honestly, at this point, less game to play, better. <sighs> I mean, she just, she literally got her jaw ripped out. Yeah. Meanwhile, we got, we got Natty Drake here. <laughs> yeah. Natalia Drake. Yeah. Uh, come on. It's just no problem. Just climb up a mine shaft, sheer, sheer cliff wall, no problem. She's All right. Good, she's got good core strength. To Jess. To Jess. Second time we drank to her, but... That's kind of mixing in Josh there, too, I guess. For their for sure deaths. Yeah. Whew! Well, I think we'll be surprised if anybody actually makes it out of here alive. God damn it. This rate? We're just, we're just killing everybody on quick time events. Except for Sam, and Chris is still alive. And Mike um, is still alive. So Sam and... Oh, wait. Emily's still alive, isn't she? Yeah, Emily's yeah, still yeah, alive. Yeah, yeah. So we still got Sam, Emily, Mike, and Chris. That's a that's double dating. That's so pretty good. we got good. four. Yep. But all the original uh, uh, dating couples aren't together. <laughs> that's okay. We can conglomerate. <sighs> you just gotta be resourceful. You gotta see what's available to you where you are. Oh, good, Lake Placid. This are is a good sure? lake to swim sure? through. Are you sure? You're positive? Alright, hypothermia, I guess, isn't a concern these days. Okay, go. Oh, my God. This is the dumbest thing I've seen, even in a video game. Yeah. Why go around? The Wendigo, you know, just love people freezing in fucking water. Yep. Yeah. I wonder if the Wendigo feel cold, because they're not wearing any underwear. They're in fucking Canada in February! And they don't even have any skin on their bones, either. Christ! Look at her calves are exposed! There was a, uh, like a totem or something behind you. Okay, we'll go pick it up. Yeah, to the left. Are you sure? Yeah. Yeah, I saw it blinking. Are you sure that wasn't just the way out? Blinking? Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure. Because I can't go left anymore. Oh, well, whatever then. Right. Yeah, I, I did see it though. Okay. We'll, we'll get it Maybe on the you next had to be in the water. Through. Maybe you had to be in the water. You know what? That's what I like Let's Play channels for. Because they actually show you how to play the game the proper way. What? This is a way to play it. Yeah, but, there, yeah. but I think what I'm going to do is instead of playing the whole game again... Let's watch the other endings on YouTube. <laughs> Where it's like, yay, you saved everybody. Chris went on to become a doctor. Matthew got killed three days later. <laughs> Jess went on to become... He did not have a good time. <laughs> yeah. Jess went on to become an ambulance driver where she continued to help out people in desperate situations. And then fucked them. She taught them how not to move. And taught them how not to move. And then fucked them. Scream, scream, scream. When's she gonna trip? Oh, she would have jacked her head. Which would be hilarious. Just one time, John. That's all it takes. One time. One time and Hayden dies. But Bye, Hayden's Hayden. amazing. Come on, all she has to do is trip. Ah! Oh no, it's it's the uh it's She's the burning back cabin. In the house. Back in the house. 
Who's in there? No one's in there. He looks like a zombie. Oh gosh, you look terrible. Gonna look worse if we stay out here. Come on. Oh, it's just under the rock. Oh no, she's just oh, gonna, she's smash gonna bash it. it in. Oh, she's So, this family owns this cabin, but they do fucking nothing with it, is what this tells me. Yeah, and it's a really nice cabin that looks like it's well kept up. And before last year, nothing happened. What do you think we should do? Yeah. We should check the basement. Which doesn't make any sense. Might be someone left down there. It makes zero sense to me. Yeah, let's go check the basement. Might be someone left down there. Ugh, God. I don't know if you guys know this, but Jess is dead now, and so is Ashley. Oh, look! We're meeting up like this. Isn't that cute? Well, Mike knows Joss died. He got his face, like, smashed in by Wendigo Hannah. Right, yeah. Wendigo Hannah. It's all because Sam didn't do her research. Yeah, let's just watch a movie. Uh, Lock the door. I'm trying to. There. Oh, shit! <laughs> <laughs> Good move, girl. Wendigos have not discovered how to open doors yet. They're not like raptors. Fucking A. One, two, three. You're all hanging out. What's four? Oh, look oh out. shit. Don't make a move. Don't. Yeah, this is just like fucking Raptor Central, you know? Yep. Her light. Oh, it's like it's vibrating on my Yeah, head. yeah, keep it from fucking vibrating. Oh my god. I'd love to see her just die right now, though. <laughs> oh no! Well, who's that? that? What is that shit? Oh, they're all Oh there. my god, look at them all. One, two, three, four. We need the helicopters. Get the attack helicopters in here. Are they killing each other? Yeah. Oh, they're not pals. Oh, they destroyed the gas line. That's a problem. But here's the thing. We killed so many of them so far. You just click on the light and the whole thing blows up? Is that the idea? Yeah, do it. <laughs> I'm ready. We'll take them all with us. What, they're not pals with each other? That doesn't make sense. That really doesn't make any sense, because they've been living together forever. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, God. I did it! Oh, you gotta unscrew the light bulb. Oh, you just break it. Okay, good idea. <laughs> Chris got the fuck out of there. Yeah. Don't fucking move! Save Mike. Hey! Ah! Badass moment. Hit it, Emily! Hit it, Emily! Hit those lights! Oh, you bitch! Oh, you moved! I didn't move. I say the same. Okay, well, she's dead. Oh, you killed Hayden! I didn't move. This is way too sensitive. You blew it. Admit it. Whatever, she's dead. I don't care. 
Well, There's your butterfly. All my butterflies went away because Hayden died. Well, so we got Emily, Chris, and Mike survived. Those are three random people. Yeah. Well, it is totally random because it's just whether you can, like, hold your fucking things. Hold your fucking things still enough. No! There's that helicopter. There we go, it's about time. I kind of like that, though. That kind of seems realistic to me. That's yeah, just three random people? Yeah. Out of the eight that we started out with? That's right, yeah! Okay, so these are all the deaths. There's two. Oh, Hannah looks pretty dead there. Ashley, time of death, 525. <laughs> oh, fuck, it's gonna relive them. Relive them all? Yeah. Josh. No, Matt. <laughs> Two hours in. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> we never heard from him again. The side character of the day. Jessica, three, six hours in. You know what we didn't see a lot of, though? Is uh, the kind of interplay, like the sort of social interplay that they promised at the beginning of the game. Like, with people getting pissed off at each other for, like, being in love with each other and stuff like that. Oh, yeah, yeah, they yeah. They totally dropped everything. And like, that was our last death right there. There's Josh. Well, there's Josh. So we killed, like, three people within an hour. Yeah, well, it's when all the deaths kind of could happen, right? Uh, the old man, I, uh... I, I don't know how to describe him, I mean... You said you thought he was stalking you at first. Did anyone else in your group think that? Well, yeah. <laughs> Is it possible they could have killed him? What? No. No, you, you, you don't understand. Don't you understand? If he attacked you... He saved my life. And I watched him die. Oh, so they don't believe right a thing they're saying. Face. Right here, mm. right in front of my nose, and he could have shot me. He almost shot me, the prick. I mean, you go out with a guy for however long, and you think you know him. <laughs> he takes the cake. He was out of his fucking mind. He wanted to hurt us. Yeah, he... And... I thought he was the one who attacked Jess. About Matt, have a... Have you found him? No. Not yet. Oh, God, he's dead. Isn't he? Yeah, you watched him die. Why do you say that? Oh, no, 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 no. He's just... Oh, my God. I was such a bitch. And I, I, you know, I maybe could have helped him. Maybe I could have saved him. Josh helped us. And then... Fuck, man. <laughs> that thing. Okay? The Wendigo. It came out of the darkness and it just... I don't know. I heard screaming. I got out of there. There's no point in both of us dying. All right. Wow. And that's it. Well, that yeah, we we actually did until dawn until dawn. We Whoa. actually we actually did it before dawn. Yeah, we got through it before dawn. Yeah. Maybe yeah, that's because we killed so many people. <laughs> I think if we actually tried to save them, it would have taken a lot longer. I think you're right. It is almost 4 a.m. Yeah. So, what did you think of the game? It was pretty good. I mean, it was classic horror story, you know. I mean, I think there was a bit of bullshit in it, like, in terms of, like, oh, people's deaths and stuff. And, like, I swear I was holding that controller as still as anybody could possibly hold it. Well, in all fairness, it's only, it's only one character. But then it's like, and then at the end, I also, I'm also like, do I really care that she died? Because I saw the story, you know? And if there are any story elements that I have yet to unlock, well, you know what? I can just go online and see what they actually are, and then I don't actually have to go through the trouble of playing the game again. Yeah, well, what I have a problem with that la that very last one was her death didn't matter then because the story still ended right after that. Yeah, exactly. Like, what? We don't get to see her little epilogue thing? Yeah, so that part I got, I got a problem with. You know, if it was before, it was, if it was earlier in the game, then it would have been different. Yeah, and I think they're trying to, they're really trying to pump up the sort of, like, uh, well, for one thing, the social interaction part was totally missing. 
Yeah, that was that was totally pointless. But I think that's the that's the point of trying to save two people that are romantic together. Yeah, but you would think that like the whole and, so, and we literally killed off yeah, the no, three but, people yeah, that had yeah, nothing yeah. to do. With yeah, <laughs> but be, yeah, at the beginning of the game, they pumped up the social interaction stuff so much, and like you know, who are you going to care about that kind of thing? And it's like they just dropped it as soon as shit started going down. It's just like, okay, you're on your own or you're with one other person, right? Yeah, it didn't really get you to be with anybody else. And once they figured out it was Josh, I think the whole, you know, they could have dealt with one after, one more chapter after that, but then they had to end it pretty quickly, but they didn't. They just dragged it on with the whole Wendigo bit, you know? I don't think it dragged on too much, though. I felt like it really dragged on. Like an hour too long? But I did not care one bit by the end of they got that. They also had to figure out their fucking, like, you know, issues with uh, what dawn counts as in February in Alberta. That's like fucking 10 a.m. Yeah, they didn't they didn't hit that at all, did they? Yeah, they did not. They did not because do Because it's like, it's like 8 a.m. here in Toronto. <laughs> yeah, well, in February, yes. Yeah, yeah, like yeah in February, yeah. it's like 8 a.m. Yep, that's right. In February, it's 8 a.m. In Alberta, it's like, it's, it's a solid, it, it Like, northern Alberta, near Edmonton, it's a solid 10 a.m. So they, they did not do justice to their uh, location. Um, I mean, there were, there were some cool things. Like, the Wendigo monsters themselves, I thought were pretty kind of silly. To me, they were exactly like the monsters you saw in Uncharted 1. It, yeah, they basically just stole them from another game and tried to make, pretend that they made sense in this game. Like, even though I admit that this this was a game stolen from so many other sources. Yeah. It still hit all the right notes with me. Hmm. Alright. The creatures themselves did not. Everything yeah. else did. There was some cool stuff in it. So. Like, the idea behind the Wendigo was awesome. But the creatures that they... That they made for that Wendigo... Yeah. Was completely ripped off. Yeah, exactly. Like, I could show you the, the, the zombie creatures from Uncharted, Drake's Fortune, and they'll be the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. It's a real unfortunate case. But, I mean, it was a slasher film. It was, uh, we tried our damnedest to kill one character. He turned out to be the guy who survived. <laughs> yeah. But he just turned into Nathan Drake, right? So at which point it's like, well, do we really need to kill him anymore? Yeah. I mean... But but still, he was a total d bag. We wanted to kill him first and foremost, and he became yeah. one of the main protagonists. Well, that's the thing though is like the game really had this clear moment where it shifted focus, and it's like characters literally shifted. The second Jess gets pulled through that window, is the second it totally turns into an entirely different game. It, yeah, you know what? You're right there because Mike's personality completely changed. Yeah. Uh, sa when when as soon as that bat uh, as soon as the bath scene hit with Sam. Yeah. She completely changed, because we didn't even see her before that. Yeah, well, she was just in the bath. That was what she was doing. She was in the bath. Right. And then everyone else there is gravy. Yeah. Whoever you can, whoever else you can say from there is gravy. It's just, in our case, it just so happened to be Emily and Chris. Yeah. And, mm, and yeah. you know, quick time event or not, Sam should be alive. Pretty much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Same thing with what's her name, that Ashley girl or whatever. No reason why she had to die. It's like, oh, you looked in the thing that is glowing white that you're supposed to look in, as we taught you to do throughout this entire game. Yeah, and then Guess she you just lost dies. The character. Yeah, yeah. It's kind of dumb. Well, it's just like you, uh, just like us with Matt. We just botched a quick time event, and he died. Just yeah. Like that. Well, yeah. I botched how many events with Emily, and she lived. Yeah. So I don't know. It's it's shit like that. I'm very I'm very curious to play this game again and do things differently. Yeah. And see what happens. So Alright. That was until dawn. That was until dawn, uh until dawn. Took and us about eight hours, I think. Took, yeah, yeah, yeah. It took us uh less than that actually. Okay. Yeah. So hope you guys enjoyed it. Yeah.